Hello, my Chic Classy Spicy family. I hope and pray that you are doing exceedingly well. Well, I have been doing a lot of shopping lately because I am preparing for spring and summer. And I found some really cool items that I wanted to share with you. And I really hope that you'll like them. This is actually my first clothing haul. So I'm pretty excited and I hope you are as well. It's gonna come from a number of different stores, Banana Republic, Factory Outlet, Banana Republic, the regular store, Express, H&M, Aldo, Alex and Annie, uh, Stylewe, just a number of different places because I shop everywhere and I had a great time doing it. So I hope you enjoy this video. Before we get started, I wanna say thank you so much to my current subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for your liking, supporting, sharing, and commenting. It means more than you will ever know. And I know I say that all the time, but it really does mean more than you ever know. To the new people who are just checking out our channel, thank you so much. We really appreciate it. I can't tell you enough how it makes us feel when we find out that new people are looking at our channel. It makes it even more gratifying to do these videos. If you have just newly subscribed to the channel, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Really appreciate it. And can't wait for you to dive in and just immerse yourself in the chic, classy, spicy family. Let's get started with this video and share some of these items because it's going to be a pretty long video. It may actually go into two videos because I did a lot of purchasing. So I will not share the prices with you during the video but they will be in the description links below because otherwise we'll take up a lot of time and we already got a lot to cover so without further ado we're gonna start with H&M first item at H&M is this really really cute striped blouse and it's pretty long you could wear it over some leggings if you are into the crop pants you can wear it over those crop pants you can dress it up with a nice pair of jeans put a cute jacket on with it there are so many ways you can wear it so this really fits in really perfectly I love it because it's really really flowy um, it's not restrictive so if I were traveling this would be a great item to take with me or to actually wear to the airport or something like that so really like that the second thing that I got is this really really cool white blouse the material is really nice it's not a cotton it may be a combination of cotton and hmm, I don't think it's polyester but it does have a little bit of pull to it so it might be a little lycra but I really like it because if you if this is something you can dress up or down and I really love the detail of the buttons the buttons at the neck and also on the sleeve another thing that I like about this one is the way it's cut at the bottom so if I decided to wear this on the outside of a skirt or a pair of pants it's really fitting so it defines your waist so I really really like that and you can never have too many white blouses at least in my closet I can't since we can't have too many white blouses, I did buy a black blouse. This black blouse is a little dressy. Let me get it in my hands. A little dressy and a little flimsy at the same time. I love it because it has its self bow. So let me let you see. Has a self bow, but it also has. I, I like to call these like the French cuff sleeves. I love statement sleeves. So it ties at the neck, but it also has a little. I guess you would call this like a keyhole little button here. This is a top I can dress up or I can dress it down. For me, I would probably dress this up with skirts or a nice pair of pants if I were going to. I could wear this to church, dinner date number of different places i like this blouse so much that i got it in white also again you can't have too many white or black blouses so that is all for h and m so we will go now to an online purchase my first online purchase with style we I actually had a very good experience so i'm pretty excited i actually bought a two-piece outfit a top and a pair of pants and here are the pants I love 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 this design one because it's different but I love it because of the colors the colors for this season 
yellows, pinks, greens are gonna be um, in. And this is really, really gonna fit the bill really well for this also because I think geometric shapes are also in for the season. And here is the top. So the pattern pretty much follows the same and I have no problem with that. I really like it. I'd probably put on a pair of cute mustard or yellow shoes to go with this or make it pop or some pink and again this is something i could dress up or down i will have to say this being my first purchase i'm pretty happy the fit was on point actually i probably could have gone up another size this was a medium just for you know just in case you gain a little weight or some water weight or something at that time of the month but perfect perfect and the designer for this outfit was cyanine c C-Y-A-N-I-N-E-C. See, hopefully you can see that. And what I like about the Stawi site is that you can purchase based on the designers that you like, that you find on their site, and you can actually favorite them. So really, really cool, I like that. And since it was my first time, I was not sure of how fast I was gonna get the purchase. I got it in less than five days, I believe. So not bad on that. Definitely be purchasing from them again. The next item is my Valentine's Day gift to myself. I'm big on taking care of me because if you don't take care of you, you won't know how to tell someone else how to take care of you. So I am big on that. So this Valentine's season, I actually bought myself this beautiful Alex and Annie ring that says love. Not only did I buy this ring for myself, but I also bought it for my daughters and sent that to them and they loved it. And that's in rose gold. And I also bought this really cool XOXO bracelet. You guys know I love XOXO. I think it's the sweetest thing. And this was beautiful. They had it in yellow gold and silver also. And I, I was gonna get the gold, but the, the rose gold just really spoke to me, so I stuck with that. And I'm really glad that I did because I actually got a surprise from my daughters. Um, they actually sent me another Alex and Ani bracelet because, or Alex and Annie, because they know how much I love them. So I'll have to show that to you one day, but not in this haul since uh, I didn't actually buy that. The next store that I did some shopping at is Aldo. Um, I always find something in Aldo, and that's probably not a good thing because it makes me spend money. But here's what I got. They had a two-for-one sale on their jewelry. So I picked up these cute black and white and gold rings. You could just never have too many accessories, and I am big on accessorizing. Love it, love it, love it. And I just bought some black and white. Work perfect. This was only like ten dollars since it was a two for one and then i found these beautiful burgundy velvet and gold earrings and they are so pretty their statements and i just love 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 them and i mean i couldn't pass it up shoot that's only five dollars per item right so i think i did pretty good and also i bought these rings that i am wearing in rose gold Hopefully you can see it. It's a set of three. And I love them. And I'm on this rose gold kick. I'm loving it. So I'm really trying to make certain I have enough accessories in my jewelry collection to wear it more often. So that is it for Aldo. And we will move on to Ann Taylor. Now I don't do a lot of shopping at Ann Taylor. And the reason is, I don't work in corporate America anymore. I own my own insurance agency and I've been in insurance since 1988. So it just made sense for me to start my own agency. And since I don't have to dress up every day and go into someone's office, it kind of just didn't fit my style anymore. So I haven't shopped in there often, but I was looking for something else while I, when I went into the Ann Taylor at the mall and they didn't have it, but I did find these really cute, really cute pants. I know, I know. The, the design is so bold. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. But what I really bought these for were because if you look, you see this little detailing here? 
on the waistband, it is also on the bottom of the pants leg. And it made me think of the pajama trend that's really gonna be big for spring and summer. There's just some things I'm not gonna do and I'm not gonna be walking around in my robe as if it's a piece of clothing that I should be wearing outside. There's a reason why you wear pajamas in the house and so forth, but that's my opinion. What works for you, you do what works for you. But for me, this is as close as I'm going to get to the pajama trend. And what I'm thinking I'm going to do with this, I'm going to put a cute, um, either a blush colored or a mustard colored blouse with this. But if you'd like to see how I dress this up or any of the other items, you will have to follow me on my other social media platforms because that's where I post a lot of pictures. So follow us on Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, Facebook. And we are going to start Snapchat soon. That's once I figure it out. <laughs> okay, that was actually the only thing that I purchased from Ann Taylor they did have some other nice items but I didn't feel like looking around anymore because I'd already spent more than enough money that day so at any rate let's keep this show going we are now on to my Banana Republic factory items again I am really really loving this stripes 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 I fell in love with this blouse the moment that I saw it. I actually had something in mind to wear it with, but I love statement sleeves, and I'm so excited that the pleated sleeves, the big bell sleeves, as you can see, I have on a big sleeve today. I love it, and again, when I saw this, I had to have it. This was actually on the clearance rack, and they did not have my size at the store that I was at, but they did find it at another store, so I drove over about 20 miles away and picked it up, so I was excited that they actually had it. Again, I had an idea for this one, but... I'm sure I can find something else because I changed my mind. <laughs> but again, this was on clearance. So, and I think this is called the Riley blouse. If you're looking for it, very cute blouse. The second item that I got at the Banana Republic factory outlet is this yellow mustard dress. And it is one of those fit and flare dresses, and I'm so short I can barely pull it up, but hopefully you can see it. What I love about this dress is actually the texture. The texture is, I don't know, the it's like, it's just pretty. I can't really explain it, but let me see if I can. You see the pattern on it? It is really, really pretty and on really looks good on my complexion. So I was really excited about it. What was funny about um, trying on the clothes for Banana Republic was that I ended up having to take everything back that I bought because it was all too big all too big. I ended up getting this dress in a size zero. Normally I am a eight in normal clothes, but for whatever reason, whenever I shop at Banana Republic, Loft, and even Ann Taylor, my size seems to either go really, really, really low or really, really, really high. So I'm never sure what size I, I am at any of those stores. As a matter of fact, those Ann Taylor pants, I had to take them back and ended up getting a six. Normally I could get a four petite. I ended up having to get a six petite in those. So go figure. And this is a zero regular. They didn't have any more petites and I really wanted this dress. So I worked it out. The next item that I got from Banana Republic is this beautiful, full floral yellow gray with hints of brown skirt I love yellows as you can tell it's just something I've always loved I always call myself Miss Sunshine and it's just it just looks so good on my skin tone if you can see how that really plays off of my skin tone and I am big on playing up what works for you. I actually ordered a blouse to go with this from Shine, so I'm hoping that it will be a perfect match because it's a different, it's not the dark brown, it's a, I don't know, it's kind of like a greenish brown, if you can see it, hopefully you can see it, because um, I didn't want to wear a gray with it, but who knows, we shall see what I pair it with. The next item I actually purchased from Banana Republic. This was definitely an impulse buy, but when I saw it, I had to have it. And when you see it, you will understand why. 
It is a maxi dress and it has three quarter length sleeves. But look at those colors. The fuchsias, the light blues, and the blacks. Oh my God, when I saw it hanging up in the display window, I was like, let me go and find this dress and see if they prayed that they have it in a petite. They did have it in a petite and I ended up getting this in a four petite. Now, there are a number of ways I do plan on wearing this dress. One of the ways I plan on wearing this dress is with jeans, with a, maybe a white t-shirt, um, maybe button up, maybe not. Um, of course, without jeans and just as a maxi dress. And I'm sure I'll figure out some other ways to wear it, but it fits absolutely awesome. So I'm really excited about it and can't wait to wear it and um, play with it and make some magic happen. So that is all of the Banana Republic items. I didn't buy anything else at the, at the store. And we are on to the Express items. I shopped at both Express and the Express Factory outlet. So I actually got some really, really good deals at the outlet store. So I'm really excited to show you, show you those. The first item that I got was this really pretty blue skirt. I love the detailing with the zipper here in the front and I love the little pockets. They're actually not pockets. I don't think no, they're not pockets. Looks like I'm feeling on myself. Not feeling on myself. But it is so cute and I can't wait to pair this with something. I just don't know what yet but it's gonna look good whatever I pair it with. The other item that I got was this really pretty skirt, of course. I love the fit and flare, especially in the summertime when your legs are bare. You've got on a nice pair of open toe sandals or some cute pumps rocking it. I can't wait to pair this with something. I'm thinking maybe a hot pink or, hmm, I don't know. You'll just have to wait and see. The next item I got was this cute little t-shirt. I am really finally getting into t-shirts and one of the trends this season is slogans. This one says, do what you love, love what you do. Hopefully you can see that. And I am doing what I love and I am loving what I do. So this was perfect for me. The next item I got was this really cute I don't know, it's not crochet, I will say pointel type designed vest. Yes, it was so cute and adorable. I had to get it, they had it in white and black and I wanted both, but I was good. I only got it in the white. And of course, with this, I'm more than likely gonna wear it with some jeans. Um, I may put it over a short, um, cute little t-shirt dress. I don't know how I'm gonna wear it, but I'm sure I'll figure it out. But I mean, how can you go wrong with it? It's such a cute little vest. The next thing that I got at the outlet store was this cute little floral skirt. Now, I love the colors in this skirt. And as you can see, I have this thing with florals. Um, I love designs as much as I love solid colors. But this one really spoke to me for some reason. I don't know if it's because of the purples. Purples, I love purples. But it also has the corals in it. It has some, not necessarily a red, but it has a lot of great colors. So you can do a number of different things with this skirt. Um, with different colored pumps. Um, different blouses. So I'm going to have fun wearing this one too. Okay. The next items that I got were these cute leather and gold bracelets. Hopefully you can see it. I got this one in black and I also got it in this cognac color. I love colors like this because this is one of those colors that you can wear with pretty much anything and it still looks good, but I love the gold detail on it. And they were on clearance. I probably got this buy one, get one free. I'll have to 
tell you and again the prices and the links to most of these will be in the description box so you will have all the information and also my sizes because you may want a point of reference as to what size the next two items I got from the Express store and they're actually the same thing and I have a tendency to do this if I like something I will buy more than one of it in different colors because if I like it I like it I actually had an idea for this particular blouse and it's actually the cute little blouse and it has these little straps at the very top so it almost looks like you could wear it off your shoulders but I like the fact that it's really not off the shoulder but it still shows a bit of skin when you put it on it's so soft and free-flowing I was thinking about wearing it with a pair of jogging pants for the athleisure trend I love the athleisure trend and um, there will be a future lookbook that has that in there so you keep your eyes peeled for that and that's what I picked this up for but I changed my mind don't know what I'm gonna wear it with I'm gonna wear it with something and who knows I may actually put it with it anyway and again I got it in black and this cream color they actually had it in a number of different colors they had it in burgundy um, and it actually was more like a berry a very deep berry they are so soft and they feel so good on the skin so I was really proud of that purchase the last item in this haul is this yummy jacket that I purchased from who what where which is at Target BAM this mustard colored moto jacket mm, 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 mm. it is so nice on matter of fact let me try it on for you these big sleeves I wouldn't of course wear it with these sleeves but as you can see really nice jacket and I do have an idea for it. Again, you'll have to check out the Instagram page and it may be in the lookbook. I know it's not fair that I'm teasing you. I'm not teasing you, but hey, I can't give everything away. <laughs> well, that is the end of the haul. I did purchase some more items, but I will do that in another haul because this one's already pretty long. I'd love to hear your comments about what were your favorite items in the haul and if you would purchase any of these items and, and why. Also, tell me what you would like to see in future hauls or in future videos. I'd like to give you what you want. For instance, would you like to know about my natural hair? Would you like to know about um, what it's like to be in the insurance industry? Why do I love being in the insurance industry? Um, would you like to know about insurance for that matter? So there's a lot of people that don't like insurance and I can understand why to a certain degree but there's also some really great benefits of having insurance so if you'd like to talk about that I'd be glad but at any rate I really hope that you enjoyed this haul but I'm gonna have to take this jacket off because a girl is getting hot and I apologize for being all up in your face but a girl has to take this jacket off <laughs> but if you enjoyed this haul I am really glad that you did because I had a great time purchasing the item. Tell me what your favorite outfits are and as always have an awesome one on purpose and keep it chic, classy, spicy. Not haunted by the way we were, I've learned to let